gosh, these are so cute. All the Dollar Tree toys are everywhere. What are you building in there? A dessert tub? Yes. Yes? That's cute. You like the slime? <laughs> you do? Yes. That one's your favorite, isn't it? Yes. Okay, here you go. I guess they are doubles. No, no. Did you not open the big one? No. No, I did. Where is it? It's right here. Oh, okay. I think these are doubles. That's a disappointment. Up here, playing. I'm in the bathtub. Put it in the bathtub? Yeah. And I'm, I'm loving these posters. Loving, loving it. Um, I don't actually think I'm going to change Goonies. Not this year. Next year, I think I'm actually going to do two sets. I'm going to do a fall one and then Halloween. So these will be part of Halloween. And then maybe Goonies will be part of fall. Can we read some books? You want to read some books? Oh, these again? You love these, huh? She loves these books. They're from Dollar Tree. Oh, all of these are from Dollar Tree. Which one? Oh, the three little piggies. No. No? I like this one. Emma Big? Yeah. Okay, she's my favorite. Look at her little bows. Calls you Pinkie yeah. Pie? Yeah, Pinkie Pie. That's so Pinkie cute. Pie. <laughs> Cutie it's Patootie? Cutie Patootie. <laughs> You're so freaking cute. Cutie Patootie. Who do you want on TV? Well, you get snacks. Thank you it's, very it's much. It's so beautiful. It, y yes, ma'am, it's very beautiful. Dollar Tree, I'm telling you. I mean, it's just, it keeps her entertained for Where hours. We don't know what that is, but we're just assuming it's cherries. But I feel like it's not. on honey we shrunk ourselves this is the second one and i've been you know just puttering around this morning i'm gonna film like this for a quick second but i'm about to head upstairs because i just got something in the mail from amazon this is a chair slip cover i'm not actually sure if i like the color or not but i want to go ahead and try it out and see if it actually 
works. Uh, if you guys remember a while back, my brother gave me a chair. It's plaid, but it's plaid. So I don't decorate with plaid all year round. I only use plaid during Christmas. So I thought, well, what am I gonna do with this chair? I don't wanna put it in the attic just to get it back out for Christmas. And then I thought, you know, I would love to have a chair in the guest bedroom. So how I'm gonna fix that is by inserting a slip cover. I have no idea if this is even gonna fit that chair, but um, it has an easy return. So if it doesn't work out or if I do like it and I want a different color, I can switch it out. Oh my Lord, I got up here and completely forgot that my niece was here a couple days ago. So you know what? Let's just do this in the usual transition. Ta-da! All right, so the craft room is a mess yet again. I really have to figure out what I want to do with this room because it's just giving me anxiety. But here's the chair and we are going to move it out of here and into the guest bedroom. Here's the chair and it's gonna go in the corner of this room, but I'm not gonna push it back just yet because we're, I'm gonna put the slip cover on it now. Okay, um, it's not working as I want it to. I keep trying to get it into those creases, but it's just not staying. But I feel like if I really just kind of worked at it, it would. But I kind of stopped myself because I just, the color, um, it's a lot more yellow um, in person, and I'm just not, I'm not liking it. So I'm gonna return this one, but you know what? It was a good effort. I'm gonna show you guys that I emptied out um, the fall bins that were over there. To be honest, they're just in another space, not put away either. But I ordered two new furniture pieces. I'm very excited. I'm not gonna reveal them just yet, but I did find them on Amazon and it's just gonna be two chairs, but I need, I need another set of seating. And then, yeah, so I'm gonna walk you through real quickly like what I'm thinking. So I'm thinking I'm gonna do a rug and then I wanna do like a fabric ottoman and I think I want the ottoman to be green. So the two chairs that I ordered are like a French country style. So I'm gonna to try to do this a little bit more in the French country style rather than farmhouse. But to be honest, if we kind of look at the rest of my decor, I feel like it leans more French country maybe. I've got two chairs and I think those two chairs are gonna be here. Um, the reason being is the back of them is just really pretty. Like I said, I want to do like a green fabric ottoman and I'll throw up some like Pinterest inspiration photos on kind of how I'm going about this. And then the seating over there is going to be more cozy because that's where I'm actually going to read. For this wall, I, I've been stumped for a while. I really just kind of like, I don't really know what I'm going to do. I'll probably just do something here. But then I decided, no, I want to do a dresser. Not another console table, but a dresser. I think it'll look really cool in here. And I think maybe I'll try to like thrift one. I'm not really sure. I'm just trying for this room to not be so matchy matchy. And uh, yeah, and then on this wall, I'm going to do, I think I'm going to do a bunch of quotes from books that both me and my daughter actually love. Once I get this put up, this is gonna be in the center and then I'm gonna add like a green greenery in here and then I'm gonna add a couple of those LED candles, like a like two or three, and then that way at night I can like turn them on with the remote and it'll look nice and cozy. One thing I'll say about these shelves is that I think I bought them pretty quickly, you know, I, I just, I didn't want to spend too much money, but I should have gone for like the bookshelves that go like ceiling to floor, but that would have taken custom work. You know, the kind where there's also like the, the movable um, ladder, like the real style home libraries, if you will. And 
but obviously I didn't go there. There is room, however, for a fourth shelf. So if I move this over more over here, I could fit another one there and then that could go there. I'm going to take a trip to Ikea. I think I'm not going to look online anymore. I'm just going to go into the nearest Ikea store and see if I can't find the seating that I actually want. If I can't find the seating that I want, I'm going to start going to like thrift stores. And if I can't do that, then there's actually um, some items that I found on Amazon. But again, like I don't want to Amazon absolutely everything about that. I definitely feel like looking at this, we, we have to add a fourth one, don't you think? I feel like it should be flushed one end to one end. The only reason why I didn't consider it at first, even though I measured it and I knew I could do four, was because of my daughter's photos. Um, if I added a fourth one, you'd really be blocking two of those. I'm really excited. We're moving. We're getting there. We're filling up some of these shelves. And I actually want like one whole shelf dedicated to Nancy Drew. I think that would be really cool to have all of her books in one shelf. And then, yeah. So that's the plan, you guys. And I feel like this could be it for today's vlog. I'm going to kind of relax the rest of the day. It's Sunday. So thank you guys for listening. Thank you for letting me bounce my ideas um, and just kind of walk through what I want to do with you guys. If you have any suggestions, definitely comment down below and I'll, I'll love to read through those. All right. Bye guys.